on a new development project in West Ashley. News 2's Emma Charles joins us live in studio. And Emma, you were at that meeting and learned more about the mayor's plan. Yes, Brendan, tonight the mayor got unanimous approval for the long-awaited Ashley Landings project. After years of an empty lot on Sumar Street, Charleston city leaders voted to approve their plan for the empty space at the intersection of Sumar Street, Old Town Road, and Sam Rittenberg Boulevard. It provides an, a gateway into West Ashley, this critical part of the city of Charleston. Mayor Coggs will present to the council what the plan for the space will look like and also presented never before seen draw-ups of the plan. He highlighted the West Ashley community's overwhelming support for the plan before the council unanimously approved to move forward. It's taking approximately 35 acres and redeveloping the old Ashley Landing site in its entirety. That includes uh, a lot of uh, local and national retail. It includes incredible amounts of park space and open space. It includes uh, uh, stormwater retention that is long overdue. Tonight, the city approved the agreement with the developer Edens. The mayor acted on behalf of the city to execute a development agreement between the entities. The city will be investing $44 million into the project. Yeah, there's been, there's been a lot of work, a lot of talk on this. I think this is a really good plan. There's a lot of thought that's gone into it. I think it is a plan that um, will frankly bring the community together rather than being a divisive plan that uh, we've seen in the past. So I'm very optimistic about it. I'm excited about it and obviously fully support it. The plan will go through a second reading at City Council in October for final approval. In studio, Emma Charles, count on two. Country